Alrighty. What's up, my people? It's been a little while since I did a talk video, and so I kind of felt like I needed to. First of all, I want to ask, how is everyone? I know some people are going through some things. School is starting back up. Work never really started. Rona makes it harder for everybody. And then this time of year is just pretty stressful. So, I hope y'all are doing alright. I know a few people that's going through some things. I feel like I needed to check up on y'all too. People going through things this time of year, including myself, uh, realizing that things around me are changing and people, people around me are changing and realizing that I don't have too many people at my, that's easily available. They're not very available. They're not around as much as I would like them to be, or maybe not around as much as they once were. People that I was once on equal footing with uh, somehow got ahead of me in two short years. It's like, just, just, you know, when reality hit different. But um, I'm on here just to update y'all on what's going around, the update video, you know, the talk video is the same thing. I felt like I wanted to do it here rather than in the Fighter Z video. Although I like to talk and play Fighter Z, I feel like I want to base the Fighter Z series, at least the solo Fighter Zs. Nah, yeah, because it would only be on the solo Fighter Zs. I want to base the solo Fighter Z videos around the game itself. I want to talk more about the game because as I look around, at youtubers that inspire me to make those solo fighter z videos ain't none of them talking about their life they're just they they may throw something in here and there um but they're mainly discussing the game or talking about the match as it's being played out which i felt like i did a good job at balancing the match and the the subject at the same time here and there like i said i will throw some things in there i will throw some things in there about my life perhaps but um, I want to mainly base it around the game. I don't want to talk the whole time about my life. Like For someone that watches their own videos, I went back to look at one of my Fighter Z gameplays. And I was there pretty much for the gameplay. Next thing I know, I'm, I'm rambling about my life. Something that's going on. It's like, you're not here for that. Shouts out to the people that are here for that, though. That are checking up on me. That, on, that, are, that do want to hear about my life. <clears throat> But I know if I was just a random guy scrolling and click the Fighter Z video, I wouldn't want to hear this guy talking about his life as he's playing the game. Uh, but maybe that's just me. I don't know. Nobody's complained, but then again, nobody ever comments or says anything. And at, the, at this point, you know, I'm not mad at anybody for that. I'm not talking down on anybody for that because that's just the way of YouTube. We talk all the time, me and my brothers, we talk all the time about how we get views over subs or views over likes or likes over subs basically anything over likes and subs prona if y'all like keeping up with his channel his most popular video has over 20,000 views no subs not enough likes for that many views not enough likes maybe those people didn't like the video i don't know my Caleb City sound effect video has over 10,000 subs now, or 10,000 likes now, and no subs, and not enough likes. It's just like, eh, I know, I know you're here for the video, but jeez, help, help a small YouTuber out. But anyway, as for updates, um, I've been trying to record more with the Elgato here and there, but I think a lot of gameplay is just going to be based around the PlayStation broadcasting feature because I just can't always set up the Elgato and then me setting up the Elgato I'm not 100% sure that I want this gameplay the difference between Elgato and PlayStation is that Elgato you have to press record you have to press record before you get into the game or before you start whatever you're gonna do meanwhile with the PlayStation you just do what you're gonna do you do what you're gonna do and you can save the last 15 minutes worth of gameplay with the elgato you can't do that which makes me self-conscious at times because i fear that i'm gonna get a whole bunch of gameplay that ends up being useless or not even as good as i wanted it to be 
so a lot of the a lot of the gameplay will be based around uh, the broadcasting feature but I'll try to make the majority of gameplay Elgato but then again that overlaps into my PC disk space which I recently just resolved most of that issue the the majority the, the biggest part of that issue but we'll see we'll, we'll still see what happens now on the background right now is a gameplay not really it, it's a little different it's not something just for you all to look at it's not a gameplay on the background I have a share factory video on the background right now that's a smite gameplay that I had before I reset my PlayStation I told y'all on the Fighter Z video that I took it in for repairs and it ended up having to wipe the entire PlayStation. Um, I was editing this Smite gameplay and it was actually coming out very well. It was coming out really good um, before I had to go and get a reset. So I no longer have this gameplay. I won't be able to see it outside of this video. It's not. There's nothing to look forward to here, which is a rip in the chat. I told y'all that also happened to a Dead by Daylight video of mine that I was really proud of. It was fully made though. That one was fully edited. I literally probably had about 30 seconds before it was published, and my goof ass cut off the PlayStation and never uploaded. I'm still sad because again, that is the gameplay that y'all should have. But it is what it is. This smite gameplay was just collateral damage, I guess. Um, this one I had the intro, and y'all know I be going big or go homes on my on my intros. My intros are like the biggest parts of the video a lot of the time. Um, but uh, yeah, I only had the intro of that video done, so I'm not too sad about that. I'm mainly sad about the Dead by Daylight gameplay, but the reason I'm not bawling about that is because it was only five minutes. Um, but anyway, <clears throat> moving on, we have, uh, you know, like I said, school starting back up. I start school today, later today, because this is, this commentary was actually recorded after 12 at night. So technically, later today, I am not going back to school. I hope not. I'm trying to do online school. I still don't have all of that sorted. Um, I don't know. Gotta talk to my mom's. But my family is really scared of the Rona, so we'll be staying in. Um, hope y'all are staying safe out there. If you do go out, wear the mask. And if you go into an especially crowded place, whether that be the mall or, or some restaurant or whatever, uh, grocery store, Home Depot, strip club, don't matter because I know those are still open. Uh, wear the damn goggles. Wear goggles, masks, shit. Walk out in a hazmat suit, gloves. Look, man, you gotta stay safe. And that thing is just, it's just spreading, dude. It's just running around. So, uh, yeah, y'all be safe from that runner. Runner scaring off a lot of people. Uh, me and my people being, being some of those people. <clears throat> uh, so, so what else? What else? Those so Elgato, PlayStation. Uh. Chilling at my grandma's. The summer was great for me. Every everything. I finished Detroit. Y'all don't know about that, but I actually did finish Detroit because I played it so much. The sessions went on for so long. Unfortunately, I can only upload an hour at a time. But the sessions. Oh my goodness, y'all. Y'all have already seen. My previous videos where I'll be recording, I'll be recording, and then it'll it'll leak into the other uh, the other gameplay. Um, so like maybe I won't have an outro, or maybe on the next video I won't have an intro. Uh, stuff like that happened quite often, and I would be playing. For over an hour at a time like that game that game is amazing and I'm not saying nothing about the ending y'all will see it soon uh, I'll probably upload I'll probably end up uploading two videos at a time uh, because there's not too much editing that will go into that 
I will let y'all know ahead of time, though, for the people that are listening to me still, that uh, I did lose a good chunk of gameplay. Um, you know, one of the things that I most feared happening ended up happening, and that being me just forgetting to press record. I'm sure every YouTuber, vlogger, whatever, whatever you're doing, if you're behind a camera, everyone fears at one point in each session that they didn't press record. What if I just did all this and, the, and I never pressed record and the camera wasn't on? Things like that. You always worry about that no matter what you're doing, especially if you're making big stunts and things. Imagine all of these parkour people, all of these prankers. Going around doing pranks on the police and stuff. Imagine if they never press record. Yeah. Uh, stuff like that. Fears like that are in the hearts of every YouTuber. Um, and that just happened to me once. And I lost like, I don't know, five. Maybe five minutes worth of gameplay. Not too much. And what's crazy about it is that I recorded. I, I realized I didn't press record on Elgato. And I was like, oh shit. Let me just record it on the PlayStation. And I'll merge it when I'm editing but that was before my PlayStation got reset so totally lost that um, that's unfortunate but uh, the show must go on and uh, that was on Detroit <clears throat> uh, so yeah uh, as for the gang teacup is Gucci he, he got his PlayStation back and he cool he edited in. he's he's actually come back better if you ask me uh, the boy got his freaking schedule right, or or is working on fixing up his schedule, and I think it's for the greater good. I think I think he's gonna come back stronger and better than he was before, of course. Uh, Prona, on the other hand, made all of our playstations had to get reset. If y'all didn't know, all of our playstations got reset. Um, it was collateral damage. All our data and stuff was collateral damage. Um, Tika or, or Peanut was he was making his videos or, or Pronut was making his videos and he was like I think he was done with like two of them and they both got deleted when they was reset so he was pretty discouraged about that and then he tried to come back and he was halfway done with a video and then it got reset again because there was only one big reset that actually fixed it, but we reset it a bunch of times before it actually got fixed. Um, yeah. And now Prona is kind of discouraged about making more videos. But he's trying to come back. Uh, I think he knows that it actually means a lot to me that he posts. Uh, I, well, for the most part. It does to... to for me, it does... The whole game, like it matters that all of us post. For me, I don't know why I take it so seriously. I was thinking just because I love YouTube so much and I love editing so much, maybe like like maybe my brothers and sister will be okay with editing as well. Maybe they'll feel the same. And I was hoping that they would because, man, when all of this is said and done. Hopefully we are successful from this, man. It'll, it'll be great. But you do have to grind to get there. And some people, not going to say any names, <laughs> just don't really have their heart in it. At least not right now. Um, <clears throat> and I'll, I'll talk more about that later. But uh, we got to we gotta wait and see some things out. Um, but yeah, the uh, Chica and Peanut, I think they're okay. Uh, with editing, I think they will make this comeback to YouTube. Um, Cass is still trying to get her stuff together. She's got plans, but execution is always the issue, as I'm sure plenty of people know. Whew, it's been a while since I actually hopped on here to ramble, like intentionally to ramble. Um, I, although I don't want this to be a 30 minute talk video because I don't think that anyone will actually stick around for that I did hop on here to ramble you know just say what's on my mind perhaps not everything on my mind but things that I want to put on YouTube you know what I'm saying uh, for Fighter Z 
again, would love to play more of that game. I don't really know why I don't play enough of that game, man. Editing is always a hassle. That's something that you got to take into consideration before you record, while you're recording, and definitely after you record. You have to think about it uh, as a YouTuber. Uh, you know, my time being on here, I see things, I recognize things, I uh, see my own flaws, and I try to improve on them. And w one of my biggest flaws that no one else sees but I see within myself is that I will record a bunch and never get around to edit them I got my PlayStation reset do y'all know I had 300 gigabytes worth of things in my capture gallery whether that be video clips pictures whatever it would just be video clips and pictures but of whatever game I had 300 gigabytes. The PlayStation only has 500 gigabytes on it. I was using under 200 gigabytes worth of space on the games themselves and 300 on my capture gallery, y'all. Just think about that for a second. Who the hell, who else uses less space on games than they do on the capture gallery? And to be honest, I don't really even see that as a flaw. I like that about myself that I want to record everything. I didn't told Prona already as a YouTuber, I feel like there's ne I never have enough gameplay. I feel the need to record almost everything. There's plenty of things that I don't record. Don't get me wrong. There's plenty of games that I have solely just to play that I would never that I wouldn't put on YouTube. That I wouldn't play on camera unless I was streaming, maybe. Plenty of survival games. I got a few Minecraft clips that I want to upload. But I play a lot of Don't Starve. And I have never uploaded that. Never recorded that. And don't plan to, really. Well, I might. Well, I actually uploaded two Don't Starve gameplays. My first ever talk video had Don't Starve on the background. And then the damn Wiz gameplay that y'all saw. Um, the gameplay with me, Tika, Peanut, and Wiz. Um, y'all saw that. But I recorded that just because it was funny. I don't actually plan to um, upload that walkthrough. Um, there's plenty of stuff that I don't record, but I feel like a lot of the stuff I do need I do need to record. But anyway, <clears throat> I uh, I had a lot of video clips that I just recorded and never really edited. And a lot of the reasons I didn't edit things was because. I just like didn't have my heart in it because when I edit I, I love editing don't get me wrong anything I edit I love it uh, I just love the editing process it's just that it's just that I I, I don't know it's just some things aren't as cool to edit as others like I'm pretty sure y'all see the difference in fighter Z gameplay fighter Z fighting gameplay versus last fight not not really because last, last fight that's a bad example y'all see the difference in stuff like the fighter z gameplay versus stuff like overcooked it's totally different y'all see the difference in overwatch versus fortnite although it's a slight difference because i love both of those games and it's like okay for example thank you the children i uploaded okay amount of think of the children but I still had like six gameplays recorded that I never touched I had one think of the children gameplay uh, recorded and about 10% edited and it was just sitting in my share factory folder for about two or three months before I actually got around to editing it and I think that was the most recent one um, overcooked as well tricky towers as well like those side games are maybe games that I don't have to record because I'd rather edit something else over them. Don't get me wrong, I still edit them and I still love it and I post it and some of y'all are okay with it. But um, don't get me wrong, man. I would rather edit Fighter Z over Tricky Towers. Let's not kid ourselves. Um, 
So I got to work on actually recording and maybe take some of Pronut's advice there and not record every single thing. Although I still will record a lot of it because I like to record a lot of it. I record a lot of it at ease just by holding the share button, you know, and pressing a button. It's not like I'm setting up my entire Elgato every time for useless gameplay. I want to sit down with the game to play Minecraft for 20 minutes and I'm going to set up my entire Elgato and record 20 minutes of Minecraft so that I can never edit it and then sit around in my folder for three months before I think about it, before I even look at it, you know? Stuff like that. But that's, 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 that's me stuff. That's YouTuber stuff. Stuff that I need to work on myself, work on my strategies and procedures and things or whatever. Um, but yeah, that was just an inside look at a little bit of what's going on. Sometimes I hate making these doggone talk videos, um, cause I come on here wanting to talk about so many things and then once I start recording, my mind kind of goes blank. Not really. Like, I, I ramble about one subject and I had 12 to talk about, so I only touch on like three subjects. And then I end the video because it's getting too long. Because I rambled about those subjects for so long. Um, I don't know. But anyway. I said I didn't want to make this a doggone 30 minute video. And this is going to take forever to upload. Just because it's 20 minutes. Uh, but anyway. Like I said. That Smite gameplay was the only of its kind. I play a lot of Smite. But I haven't uploaded any Smite. Uh, y'all not finna see Smite for a little bit, <clears throat> because I'm kind of discouraged on that, not gonna lie, I really like the way that first one was coming out, and that ended up failing miserably, because it got deleted, um, but anyway, thank y'all for watching, to the few of you that actually listen to this point, which I doubt, because to be honest, if I were you, I wouldn't be here either, probably not. Um, I got some bangers coming soon. I got some surprise gameplays for y'all. Um, I plan on getting things done. I plan on doing a lot of things, but I always plan on doing things. You always got plans. The execution is the problem. That is the moral of today's story plans all these thoughts i can spit out for days i can talk for damn years in this mic about what i want to do what i can do what i'm thinking of doing my flaws and things i need to change but execution are you gonna do it though how you gonna do it when you gonna do it you know what i'm saying not even about that just are you gonna do it anyway Thank y'all for watching, man. I got some bangers coming, so stay tuned. Tell your granny to subscribe. Tell your mama to subscribe. Tell your sister. Tell your brother. Tell your girlfriend, boyfriend, significant other, what the fuck ever. Tell everybody to subscribe, because I got some bangers coming, man. Thank y'all for watching. I'm going to see y'all on the next video, man.